Well, hello everyone and welcome back to Lisa's Coloring Corner. I was contacted by a new to me diamond painting company called Craft Art Club to see if I wanted to show a few diamond paintings from them for you guys on my channel. So let's see what they sent me. I have two diamond paintings and then kind of a kit to do. So let's look at this kit first. Now, at first I thought me, they sent me the wrong one because I knew I hadn't picked out this particular item. But they must just have a standard box that they put their items in and then they put a picture um, glued up in the corner of the actual item that you get. Because I picked out this cute little lamp. It's a, well, it's a light up stand. So let's take a look at it. It comes in this nice heavy duty cardboard box so you know it's not going to get damaged in shipping well hopefully not so let's see what's all in here oh you get everything in here you get the little bitty screwdriver and everything always nice when they include everything and the drills and a toolkit so we get our standard toolkit single placer pink drill pen few baggies, square of wax, and the standard green tray. And here is our image. Let me zoom in a little bit. So we have Santa Claus holding a bag of toys. Isn't that cute? Oh, he even has toys in his pocket. <laughs> Wasn't room in the bag. So we do have two of these to drill because there is a front side and then a back side. So you have quite a bit to do on here. It is all special drills and, and rhinestones or some call them crystals. So we'll take a look at those. So what do you all get with this kit? Let's take a look. Besides just this and the drills, I am really not sure how this goes together. <laughs> I'm sure, ooh, well, you will, you know, of course, do the diamond painting first and then put it together. Okay, this, I'm assuming you will, this is double-sided, spongy, like 3D stickies that you will peel the front and back off and stick the two together. I'm assuming. Then, like I said, we have our little screwdriver. I'm not quite sure what that's for. There are no directions in here. Let's see if there's anything on the box. Nope. So it's kind of figure it out. <laughs> These must be your little lights. So again, I am assuming we have holes, you know, all the way around. So they must go in each of the holes. So I'll just put a couple in. And then this, again, assuming you will stick on the back. And one fell out. Put the light through the other side, stick it in here, so then the two pieces stick together. So yeah, I'm, this will not work then to stick the two together because this, of course, is going to make the two farther apart. Let me look at the picture again. Unless you put the sticky on the bottom so it stands up, maybe. Because otherwise it may fall over easily. <laughs> that could very well be. I guess I'll have to kind of play around with it. I am not sure, though, with, you know, no being plugged in or, all right, there's got to be more to it. <laughs> there's got to be. Oh, yes, there it is. I'm like, how? Where is the power to light these things up? There is more to it. <laughs> we have a battery pack. 
All right. So you do connect. The lights to this and there is an on off switch okay so it does take two double a batteries okay so that's where you plug in each of the lights it looks like there's a connector on this cord. Oh no, this is what lights up. Okay, so the little lights are actually in this cord. These are just the pegs to hold the two pieces together. And yeah, I'm assuming you push them in here. Okay, so yeah, this is actually what lights up. And like I said, there's an on off switch interesting I'm not sure if this somehow goes inside I would assume so so yeah I'll definitely have to do some playing around with this or if it just comes out the bottom yeah I'll have to work on this and then uh, at the end of the month when I do you know, my video where I show everything that I colored and diamond painted for the month. So I'll try to have this done by the end of November. No guarantees. It may be the end of December. <laughs> okay, so, so I'm not exactly sure what you need the screwdriver for. Oh, okay. So these are just clear screws. So you will screw them into each of these I see well that'll be much more secure then so yeah these are actually little screws awesome I'm gonna get all these little things back in here or I'm gonna lose them because <laughs> there's quite a few here let me get these all back in the baby I shouldn't have dumped them all out I could just see these rolling off my desk onto the floor. And because these screws are clear, it would be very hard to find. But that'll be very pretty with the lights. Much, much nicer than a standard screw. All right, so let's get this back in here. And we're going to look at the drills and yeah I'll look and see what these are for maybe I'll use them not how they're intended but we'll see oh I just think he's so cute <laughs> I like bringing you guys to something different once in a while than just the standard diamond painting some don't like you know standard diamond painting so Kind of nice to see something different. We'll look on the, the back side. You can see the the pretties a little bit better. So we have some pretty silver. Oh, look at the red. And then a little bit darker red. Some regular round drills, but these are ABs with that special glimmery kind of mother of pearl type coating. It's like a dark orange or kind of a brown. The green, because you got to have that with the red, right? Oh, I love this color. This light pink. And then some more dark orange. Not quite as dark as those, though. And then we have one special drill. It's a bigger round yellow. Oh, it's going to be so cute. So, you know, we do have another special drill. Did I miss them? Yes, I did. We have some teardrops. It's pretty kind of red, pinky kind of looking red. Again, with that AB coating. Because I seen there was some teardrop shapes on here. I'm like, wait a minute. 
So those will go down here in those bigger yellow rounds. Oh, it's going to be cute. And it's nice that it's battery powered, powered so you don't have to have an outlet nearby. I have the perfect spot for this in my living room. <laughs> All right, so that is the lamp or lighted decoration, if you will. Let's get these back in here and we'll take a look at the diamond paintings themselves. I will get everything back in the box off camera so you don't have to see me struggle. <laughs> There's a number of things to get back in there. So I'll just set that up there. Nice little project for me to do in the living room. All right, so here is the first diamond painting. This is a 30 by 40, and I have a kitty cat coming over to visit. And we'll see if uh, she appears in the camera or not. Isn't she pretty? I'll zoom out a little bit more so you can see her. Uh, so yes, 30 by 40, full, round. There are 25 colors in this. Beautiful shades of pink and some purple, blue, pretty bright green down here. And color key, upper left, lower right, we do have the number the symbol, and the DMC code. And we do have a Cali. <laughs> okay, let's take a look at the drills. Oh, we do get another standard toolkit. Hopefully, Cali will stay perched over here on the side. Again, I'm going to turn the bags over, but we do have the number, no DMC code on the packages themselves, but that's okay. Oh, I love these. Pretty colors already. We have pretty lavender. Oh, and they're very sparkly. I don't know if you can see that on camera or not. Dark purple. Kind of an olive green. Oh, another lavender. Big pack of very light tan. Oh, this very pale blue. A couple of more blues. Kind of a gray blue, another tan. Oh, big pack of, isn't that pretty? It's kind of like a coral color. A little bit lighter. Oh, pretty pink. Magenta. Oh, I'm loving these pinks. Kind of a salmon pink. Another blue. And more pinks. Blue. That's a big pack. A few more colors. Bright lime green. Great purple. <laughs> Another orchid. Oh, pretty blue. And a huge pack of white which I'm assuming is going to be in her wings. Things like that, right? In her dress. So yeah, we will have a lot of white in there because that is L, yeah, 35.65. So let's take a look at the symbols and if they are clear. Yes, it looks very nice. Let's look up here where it's a little bit darker. They are a little bit harder to see. I think rather than having them in black, it would have been better to have these up here in white. With a light pad, this won't be a problem whatsoever. But if you don't work with a light pad, make sure you have good overhead lighting. <laughs> Because, yeah, they they are a little, little hard to see. These are all R's, though. Um, so even without a light pad, I can see them quite easily. N's. 
But yeah, I, I would have suggested maybe having those in white lettering. Otherwise, very, very easy to read. Oh, it's so pretty. Okay, so let's zoom back out a little bit. Get this one away. And we shall look at the other one they sent me. So a big, big thank you to Craft Art Club for sending these to me to show you guys on my channel. I will link their website down below in the description, as well as all three of these items. So it's much easier. Sorry about that. Much easier for you to uh, find this item if uh, it interests you. And I, again, always print out a thumbnail of that particular picture and tape it on here so I know what's in each package without having to take them all out. Isn't that pretty? All right, so let's, let's get some tape. And then I write the name, the company name on here. So again, I know who it's from when I do that particular gem in painting. So let's check out the next one. This is another 30 by 40. And again, I'm going to zoom back out a little bit. Oh, it's so cute. <laughs> another full round standard toolkit. Look at the bright colors in this. So we have our family of Christmas bears. There are 24 colors in this picture. Again, color key, upper left, lower right, with the color number, the symbol, and the DMC code. Now, there's a lot of detail going on in this picture. A lot of times, I, I don't like picking the smaller diamond paintings when there's a lot of detail or when there's wording, um, especially wording very hard to read unless it is a larger diamond painting. So there is a lot of what we call confetti going on in this diamond painting and that just means that um, there's a lot of colors in one area. Um, takes a little bit longer to do because you're swapping out colors a lot unless you're one that has multiple trays out at the same time. But because of that confetti I I think this one is going to show the detail well enough when you look at it, of course, from back farther up close. It is definitely going to look pixelated, but that's true for any diamond painting. I just loved the colors in here and the image itself. So very, very cute Christmas image. Let's look at the symbols. And this one is very easy to read. In the darker areas, they do have it on white, so that's nice. In here, too. And then, of course, the light areas, they have it in black lettering. And there are no symbols in here. I didn't check the other one. It is all letters, so that's kind of nice little bit easier to read. All right, let's look at the drills for this one. So we're going to have a lot of bright colors. Oh, look at that. Okay, so we have a big train and a caboose. Red, gray, blue, pretty lavender, big pack of red. <laughs> oh, look at those bright greens. 
Oh, I love that bright spring greens. A couple of yellows. Pale gray. Kind of like a yellow ochre. A couple of blues. Another green. Tan. Oh, I love the mint green. Kind of a burnt orange. A couple of pinks. I love that color. Another blue. We have a dark gray. Another big pack of red. A little bit lighter than the other one. Kind of a dark orange. And a huge pack of white. Let's find an emptier pack. And let's, because this is a new company to me, they're all pretty full. Let's look at the quality of the drills. I don't see any trash. I don't see any stragglers <laughs> into the next bag. Sometimes you have a lot of stragglers, which is no biggie. They look very nice. Like I said, they're very sparkly. They all look very similar in size. A couple concave on the bottom, but again, not a deal breaker. So these are acrylic drills, not resin. Resin is a little bit higher quality, but a little more expensive to make too. So yes, these look very nice. So another nice budget friendly option that is out there. We really are getting spoiled <laughs> by all of these diamond painting companies that have popped up now over the past couple of years. If you are one that can't afford or don't like spending the money on the premium companies, yeah, you don't have to spend a fortune to get into this craft. Let me get done putting this away. Because we now do have a lot of budget-friendly diamond painting companies out there. So, thank you again to Craft Art Club for sending these to me to show you guys. It is truly appreciated. And again, I will link them down below in the description, as well as these three items for you guys. So there you go. We have our adorable bear Christmas picture. Pretty angel. And our light up ornament kit. So thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed the unbagging and unboxing <laughs> of these diamond paintings. If you did, please hit that thumbs up button. Subscribe if you're new to my channel. I hope everybody's having a fantastic day. And as always, happy coloring and happy diamond painting. Bye guys. <laughs>